Okay, this is testing the 03, early 04, 6.0 power stroke. It's the what we would call the seven pin, because it, it has seven screws underneath this cap here on the pick'em. It has a different location to test versus the four pin, and I already have a video showing that one on how to test it. So I'm gonna go ahead and show on this one where we test on the seven pins, what to look for and um, what we're doing here. First thing I want to do is make sure I don't contaminate anything inside, so I'm going to blow it off. This is a Torx 20. Now once you get this off, you want to look inside at your seal, make sure that it's not damaged, and also clean off anything that's going to prevent it from sealing. Because if you get any moisture back inside this victim, you're definitely going to damage it. It doesn't take much to ruin these. So go ahead and do that, wipe off along here. Now we're tested. Yeah, I have it set on voltage direct current it's the setting we want to use and on the seven pin it's up here what we tested on the uh, with the four pin it is down there at the bottom but on these that have seven screws it has the three on top the four on the bottom we're going to check it here so I'm going to go ahead and turn the key on and see what we get Okay, we have the 47.8. Anything above 45 is a pass. I don't like to see them go under 46 volts. So this one's definitely a pass 47.8, uh, but that's also key on engine off. We need to check these at an idle. It's also nice if you have help to check it during the pre-cycle clatter and check it at 2000 RPMs. When cold, that's when it's stressed the most at about 2,000 RPMs when cold. So I'll go ahead and start this one up and check it and we'll watch what the voltage does on this one. Okay, we're checking it here on the top, on the row of four. On the seven pin, we check it on the top one. On a four pin, we check it on the bottom. So I'll go ahead and put it on here. I'm gonna turn the key on, then at any time if the uh, voltage drops below 45, it's junk. So we wanna check it, if it's a no start, check it during the pre-cycle clatter. If you don't have the pre-cycle clatter, we'll fix that problem first. But so now we'll go ahead and check it during the key cycle, and then at idle, then we'll raise it up to 2,000 RPMs. And of course, again, the best time to do this is when it's cold, at the coldest state it's going to be. The, um, so this one, we're gonna go ahead and check it, key on. Okay, we have the uh, 48, 49 volts. And then let's go ahead and start it up, let it idle. good it's dropping now because we have the key off the uh, so this one passes it's still got has the rough running so we're gonna go out to an injector on this one and if you have the capability to then do your uh, key on engine off injector electrical self test make sure it's not a wiring issue but as far as voltage wise this victim is passing so that's how you check the uh, the seven pins thank you